On March 22 Friday a team of the Archaeological Survey of India began the survey of the ancient Hindu worship place that Bhojsala complex situated in the tribal dominated Dar district of Madhya Pradesh. The ASI team from pricing of more than a dozen members accompanied by senior local police and district administration officials reached the complex. The survey began after MP High Court Indore Division on March 11 directed the ASI to conduct a scientific investigation survey and excavation of the complex. The High Court granted the order for scientific survey based on multiple evidence and signs submitted before the court. The 11th century Bhojshala is an ASI protector monument. Hindus believe it is a temple of goddess Vag Devi where the Muslim side dispute is claiming it's a Kamal Maula mosque. During the excavation in 1987, the ASI discovered over 32 idols of Hindu deities including Lord Pugair. The pillars of Bhojshala are adorned with figurines of Hindu god and goddesses. Eight lotuses were found on the roof above the pillar. In addition to what has already been mentioned, a number of other artifacts unearthed within the Bhoj Shala 1987 discredited the propaganda that the complex was uh, belonged to Muslims. The current Kamal Mala Mosque, which was erected by Muslim conquerors after the temple was raised, had remnants of Bhoj Shala. The carved pillars used in the mosque are the same one used in Bhoj Shala. Engraved stone slabs afflicted to the mosque walls still contain valuable work. These inscriptions go in great depth above Sanskrit grammar. Some inscription praise the emperor who came after Raja Bhoj. There is also inscription in classical Sanskrit with theoretical com- composition. These uh, inscriptions are dated back to characters based on 11th and 12th century. The temple was considered the centerpiece of Dhanagiri's 84 square, the city of palaces, temples, universities, theatres and gardens. The goddess Saraswati statue is currently housed in the London Museum. There are some of the Hindu artifacts found in the 1987 in, uh, excavation. So many pillars have been found. A massive yagina couldn't exist in the premises. Raja Bhoj had 84 texts written out of which two instructions are also present there. In a room occupied by SI, there is a statue of two gatekeepers on either sides of the door. Om Namah Shivaya is written in Pali language. Another black stone has been preserved by the ASI, bearing the writing of Om Saraswati Namaha. On the entrance, there is a bell sculpture. Adjacent to the Bojshala complex is a small well-known known as Ak- Akal Kuya. It is thought that the torch and anointing of Goddess Saraswati once cleaned in the water over there. In 1305, 1401 and 1514, Muslim monarchs wrecked the magnificent temple over there. In 1305, the ruthless and barbaric Alauddin Khilji destroyed Bojshala for the first time. In 1269, a Muslim fakir named Kamal Maula reached Malwa. He utilized deceitful methods to convert many Hindus to Islam. He gathered 36 years uh, information on the area and turning it over to Alauddin Khilji. Alauddin Khilji said to have massacred over, to, over 1200 Hindu students and teachers for refusing to convert to Islam and he demol- demolished the temple complex. The current mosque is na- in the name of the same deceit known as Kamal Maula. Another Muslim invader Dilawar Khan des- demolished the Vijay Stump and attempted to turn the portion into a darga in 1401. Muslim performed namaz at the same Vijay Mandir today. Again in 1514, uh, Mahmud Shah besieged Bochal and attempted to transform it into the darga. In 1952, the central government gave up Bochal to the ASI. Prior to March 12, 1997, Hindus performed uh, darshan but were unable to do puja. In 1997, CM Digvijay Singh issued an order permitting Muslims to offer namaz at Bochal every Friday but prohibited Hindus from entering the Bhojshala. Hindus were only permitted to enter and offer puja during Vasant Panchami. In uh, April 20, 2003, Bhojshala was finally opened again for the Hindus. Darshan was allowed to devotees every day apart from Tuesday. In order to regain the complete access to the place of worship, the current petition has been filed. So now they are doing an ASI survey. Pratakshko Pramani Kafi, why is the survey even being done in the first place?